Okay, now this will be the last phase of the orthodontic module. This is a chance for us to review the uh, plan, and you can see the teeth move with the buttons. These will be what each model looks like once printed and ready for the aligner fabrication. We can then add a uh, label to the model, find a place that has some open space. If we click on show label, you will see the patient's name and the model of the num of the uh, of the specific model, the number of the model. As you zoom in and out, the label stays the same size, whereas the model gets larger or smaller. Click a spot, select apply. You will see this take a little while because it's going to apply this label to every single model in the plan. And with a, a larger case like this with 25 uh, different models, it's going to have to apply that label to all 25 models. You may at the end find an error screen that pops up. That happens fairly often. You can just move ahead and ignore that error has to do with a hole that may be generated in the alignment phase but will not affect your printing uh, most of the time. So hit OK. That's uh, almost never an issue. And we can also go ahead and now export our models. So we're going to export these. I'm going to create a new folder. Call this the Upper Treatment Models or whatever you want to call them. And now that is exporting all of these models there for print, uh, for you to print, or for you to send to a printer. Lastly, we can create a report. Okay, and I like to add to the end of this upper in case I am treating treatment planning the lower as well. And here's an example of what that uh, report looks like. It's going to have the patient's name up top. It's going to show you a, um, a final screenshot of the case, show you the IPR values for the specific positions, and in every phase, what movement is occurring. Okay. And then last but not least, you do want to make sure that you save your case. So we're going to call it, I'm going to also, once again, I'm going to add the term upper. You might change that to maxilla, mandible, your preference. Now it's saved. I can come back in here and edit it as I need. I can use this as to dis show my patient the overall workup, and they can approve it prior to printing if I want, uh, and prior to beginning of treatment. Hopefully that helps to uh, show you the process of the software. Please let us know if you have any questions. Look forward to more videos showing more advanced functions.